Maybe you're one of those students with a job lined up after graduation, or maybe you're thinking about traveling. More CU Boulder students are signing up for a little of both as volunteers for the Peace Corps. In fact, CU is currently ranked number three among all U.S. colleges and universities for the most alumni serving as Peace Corps volunteers. Peace Corps offers all kinds of programs, business, agriculture, education, and especially HIV AIDS assistance in Africa. The Peace Corps assists over 130 countries, mostly in third world. I was in the Republic of Georgia, um, which is a former Soviet Republic, it's south of Russia, um, and I was an English teacher in a secondary school. Whatever your interests are, whatever your background is, your major, I mean, there's something that's going to suit you in some way. There are still many people who seem wary about joining the Peace Corps, mostly out of fear and feelings of homesickness. It's really important to just keep in mind the bigger picture, and, and I mean, I was so passionate about what I was doing that it was, it was worth it completely. And it also gave me perspective so that when I came home, I appreciated my loved ones so much more. To date, more than 6,000 Coloradans have volunteered in the Peace Corps, afterwards joining the ranks of professionals that include law enforcement. We, were, we would bring them to court because uh, I would work with the locals there. So I wasn't just on my own, I, I, had, I had companions. Today, the Peace Corps motto is, life is calling, how far will you go? But it hasn't always been that way. Well, when I became a, a Peace Corps volunteer, the motto back then, back in the 70s, uh, the motto was, it's the toughest job you'll ever love. Students may find that the benefits of their experience are endless. The most beneficial thing for me was gaining a sense of confidence and trust in my own abilities as a human being. Even though it's primarily a volunteer position, the Peace Corps offers a $6,000 readjustment allowance when you return. It also looks great on a resume for graduate school. Even though the average volunteer is 25 years old, people older are still encouraged to join, especially people with more work experience. Currently, the oldest volunteer is 79. And personally, I feel like everybody should, should have this experience or something like it at some point in their life because it really does sort of mix things up and, and changes, or broadens your, your worldview, I think. It's a great experience. You know, I, I recommend that to anybody who would like to see the, see the world, share your culture, and uh, just learn. So, if you're thinking about joining at the end of the semester, well, the application can be tedious, which takes on average about nine months. And so far, I've just turned in, you know, basic application stuff, previous jobs, and my background, and transcripts. We've all been in the basement of the UMC to buy books, but did you know that the Peace Corps office is located just right around the corner? Here, I'll show you where it is. The office is located in room 1B27A. Come here to learn more about the program. The benefits are everlasting, and joining the Peace Corps can get you to start singing to a new tune. This is Lindsay Rye, News Team Boulder.